Hello, band team. Let's learn about Jacob meets Esau. Jacob learned, look up, and there was Esau coming with his 400 men. So he divided the children among Lee, Rachel, and the two female servants. He put the female servant and their children in front, Lee and her children's nets, and Rachel and Joseph in the rear. He himself went on the hand and bowed down to the ground seven times as he approached his brother. But Esau ran to meet Jacob and embrace him. He drew his arms around his neck and kissed him, and they weep. Then Esau looked up and saw the woman and children. Who are those with you? He asked. Jacob answered, They are the children of God, graciously giving your servant. Then the female servant and their children approached and bowed down. Next, Lee and her children come and bow down. Last of all come Joseph and Rachel, and they too bow down. Esau asked, What the meaning of all those flocks and herds? I meant to find favor in your eyes, my lord, he said. But Esau said, I already have plenty of my brothers. Keep what you have for yourself. No, please, said Jacob, if I have found favor in your eyes, accept this gift from me. For to see your face is like seeing the face of God. Now that you have received me favorably, please accept the presents that we brought to you. For God has given has been gracious to me and have all I needed and because Jacob insists Esau accepted it. Then Esau said, Let us be on our way. I accompany you. But Jacob said to him, My Lord knows that the children are tender and that I must care for the ooze and cows that are nursing their young. If they are German hard, just one day all the animals will die. So let my Lord go on ahead of his servant while I move along slowly at the pace of the flock and hears before me in the peace of the in the pace of the children until I come to my Lord and sure Esau said then let me leave some of my men with you but why do that Jacob asked just to just let me find favor in your eyes of my Lord so that they used to start it on his way back to sure Jacob however went to Sukuku, where he built a place for himself and made shelter for his livestock. That is why the place is called Sukuku. After Jacob come from Panan Aram, he arrived safely at the city of Skumu in Canaan and camped within sight of the city. For a hundred pieces of silver he bought from the son of Humor, the father of Skumu, and the plot ground where he pitched his tent, and there he set up an altar and called it Elulu Israel. Please sub, like, share, and I'm out of here.